All right, guys, I'm back with another video. Um, this is gonna be on my video gate setup and how I have everything wired with the computer and the audio. Um, I hope that music's not too loud in the background there. I always have music on in the background while I'm here. Um, <laughs> a couple of the videos I think it was too loud. But uh, anyhow, uh, real, this is gonna be really quick. And then uh, I have to pre-explain a few things here before I get into the, the wiring. Uh, okay, in my, in my audio chain, I use my rack gear. The last piece of rack gear in line is my compressor limiter gate. All right, and on the back, it's a two channels. So the input has uh, two different style jacks. It has a uh, XLR input, and it also has a quarter inch jack input. All right, same thing with the outputs. It'll have uh, two outputs, one XLR for an XLR cable, and the other for a quarter inch uh, cable. Now normally you wouldn't use both of these together, you use either one, because uh, say you're just only using this one, and you have a certain audio level, and then you plug something else into the quarter inch jack, you could notice a decreased uh, sound level coming out, uh, say for the anon. But using this scheme, I can uh, compensate for that because I'm doing over channel two. I'll explain it in a second. All right, and then uh, down here, I'm gonna explain this, is my back panel of the computer. All right, so you'll notice with any computer, you're gonna have a green jack and a blue color jack. All right, your green color jack, is for your audio out, and the blue jack is for computer audio in. All right. Now the thing I gotta pre-explain here are these are Y cables. All right. So it's a uh, male eighth inch stereo jack to plug into the back of the computer. On the other side of Y's out. Um, on each side of the Y, it's a female eighth inch jack it's set up for stereo or tip ring sleeve on both sides there. Okay. Same thing with the audio in. Same, same Y cable right there. Okay. Uh, let's see, okay. Also, I run NCH software of both the VideoPad video uh, editor and the debut video slash screen recorder, okay? While I'm recording the screen, I need to pipe audio back in, uh, into that software. Okay, so, got to hear my compressor limiter gate, all right? The outputs. I didn't show all the outputs. I only show what I'm using on the outputs or, or inputs. All right. So channel one output for the XLR output. I go right to the anon. That's the RCA jack on this side. of plugs in the back of the anon. Okay. So for my speaking voice, I go the quarter inch output and I pipe that over to the channel two input. All right. I'm using the quarter inch jacks. Uh, there's just a uh, mono cable or tip sleeve cable to uh, jump those two together, okay? Now, the output of channel two, I, again, use the quarter inch jack, all right? It's gonna be quarter inch, tip sleeve or mono, all right? Once I plugs into there, and then on the other side of this cable is a stereo eighth inch male tip ring sleeve uh, jack, okay? So that comes in, plugs in one side of the Y for the audio in. All right. So now, let's see here. Oh, so up here, stereo coupling is off. So it's independent. My audio level going to my Anon is independent of the uh, audio level going to my NCA software. Because they're not independent. Say uh, it was too loud. Oh, my, my speaking voice is too loud in the gate. If I turn that down, it'll also have an effect on the sound. Uh, going out to the anon, so it's nice to have them separate. Okay. So, uh, okay, yeah, XLR, just gets on the anon, audio in, pipe this over, channel two, output. Okay, we come down the output, like explain the cables and everything, and one side goes in the audio in, all right? Now, coming out of here, the green jack is audio out. Now, that has the anon receive uh, audio, all right? So, like I said, the NCH needs a audio source, so what I do, on one side of the Y, I jump over, I have a uh, male to male eighth inch stereo cord. I jump these two Y cables together and pipe the audio right back into the input. All right, on the other side of this uh, Y cable, that's where I plug my headphones into. So, yeah, simple. I'm sure there's another way to go about it, but uh, from my video gate setup and everything I have here at my station, uh, yeah, this works.
great, simple, and uh, it's been doing me well for for years. Um, I have another video out um, when I use a separate SDR that got into uh, I had you have to have a mute box in line and everything. I'm not going to get into that. But uh, there you go. That's my video gate setup. And by the way, you are hearing when you watch my video gates, you hear the exact audio that I dump into the Anon. I have nothing to hide. So you hear exactly how my, you know, my audio sounds out of my rack here. And on the screen, you're saying exactly, it's like sitting in my shop. When you're, when you're watching my video games, it's like you're sitting in my shop. So it's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, open and upfront about how I, how I do things. All right, I'm gonna get on out of here. Hopefully you kind of understood that. So, all right, I'll check you later. KP68, Mudducking here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, back out.